Nigel Misha here. This is a quick video to show you guys uh, the new way that we're going to be interacting with AI systems. Um, I call this parallel UI or something like that for lack of a better name. Um, yeah, so it's a quite quite a cool way to interact with AI in a parallel way rather than in a linear way. So by a linear this is actually what I mean. When you type in something in ChatGPT, it comes up uh, in a chart like this and you have to scroll up and down to access that information. The problem sometimes is that you may forget some information just because it's not uh, in view. You can, um, but with this, you can actually perhaps uh, work on projects where you need to explore different ideas at certain points, but you need to remember them so you keep them close like this um, so um, I can actually show you this uh, cr actually creating uh, a block like this too so we're gonna say what mantras should I learn and then I tap on that so you should see it create the block as you can see it's created a block right here so I'm just gonna move it up here give it a little bit of space when i tap on it i get the block uh, i get the blocks subtopics which i can actually explore and if i want i can actually type something in an instruction to use uh, the block that you're, you're you're clicked on as context so uh, tell me five mantra practices that I can use so I did that and I tap on save and you should see it create as you can see there it's created a block now I can actually uh, explore the information in that block right there and just um, something that's so cool about this that uh, once you create a block you can always go and explore it at any time like that for example you can i can explore that i can um so the information that it contains is already stored and it's, it's such a nice i feel efficient way to explore information uh, i can go to the calculator in javascript here click on the code and if I wanted, I could actually create more blocks uh, using the using the, the context that I'll be I'll be providing from a block that I clicked on. Like for example, this block right here. Um, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this project. I believe this is the way that we're going to be interacting with AI in the future. Um, yeah, I'm quite excited that I managed to put this together and actually make it work right now. It's been something that's been on my mind for quite a bit. Um, so, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, see you guys on the next one.